Hey guys, it's Diamond from the Oppenheimer Ranch Project. I'm doing a quick space, space weather update for you guys. Uh, because our sun, even though we're going into solar minimum here on Solar Cycle 24, has been quite active the last few days. Let me just show you the X-ray flux. Here we are currently, and we've had uh, quite a few M flares. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, at least in the last 48 hours. And these are the ones that uh, are particularly of interest to us uh, in the next few days. So here's some, uh, one of the M-class flares that came out of sunspot region 2673 on the sun. Let me show you where that is. There's the sunspot right here, which is right here. And it's about to roll around uh, in the next day or so and be out of the region. But when it was earth facing, Um, here we are in the end little spiral plate page and this is uh, what the prediction is so there's the blast and there's the earth right here this yellow spot and this is the coronal mass ejection that's going to hit us it's pretty significant notice it's black and white that's a pretty significant uh, and here's the prediction so it's going to arrive sometime on the 7th and last through the ninth here as far as plasma density etc now what does that mean for us we are currently here in a proton storm a radiation storm cosmic rays coming in a level 2 geomagnetic storm so what that means for us is a few things here you get a view of the uh, coronal mass ejection that's earth facing so what you get is this halo effect when it comes out in all directions we know it's coming right at us space weather affects weather on earth and this is the strongest recorded hurricane Irma this picture is from 6 minutes ago right now it's 9.30 mountain time on September 5th PM and this has reached 918 millibars and it's predicted to go as low as 879 on models I've looked at which would be the strongest hurricane ever recorded in human history currently the strongest hurricane in this part of the Atlantic here we got the Dominican Republic Puerto Rico it's headed uh, the Lesser Antilles are right here somewhere so it's about to make landfall in a few hours there but this geomagnetic storm that's coming is going to intensify this storm, maybe breaking all records, uh, even the models aren't showing. I think that this is going to be the strongest storm in recorded history uh, because of what's going to happen from the 7th to the 9th. And you're going to see a lot of this red starting after September 7th and because we're, we're going to be in geomagnetic storm. What does that mean for people in the planet? Well, geomagnetic storm effects here, radiation hazards to humans, especially those in space, but those on Earth. There are health effects from geomagnetic storms. Migratory animals less able to navigate, communication disruptions. We're going to see ground to air, ship to shore, shortwave broadcast and amateur radio disrupted. Also problems with GPS, Loran, radar, satellites, the internets will go down. Keep your eye on September 7th, 8th, and 9th for all this to be happening, especially when the main shockwave comes on the 7th in the morning. Satellite hardware damage, power grid outages. We've had outages from other geomagnetic storms recently, so keep your eye out for, for power outages on the 7th and 8th. Uh, the most important thing uh, why I want to stress this video, during geomagnetic storms, there are health effects. So geomagnetic storms are when the KP index gets up here above five and cosmic ray alerts were in a proton flux right now, which would be down in this area. But geomagnetic storm alerts, which are going to be happening on the 7th, 8th and 9th. Uh, and just take a look at this chart of what is at risk here. Heart rate fluctuations, heart palpitations, your heart can flutter. Coronal syndrome, blood pressure increase, seizure, migraine, anxiety, suicide risk. 
Um, I've seen a lot of correlation and crazy things happening recently in Oregon during a geomagnetic storm. Um, a terrorist attack recently happened during a geomagnetic storm. So look for crazy things happening on the 7th, 8th, and 9th in the U.S. and Europe on the, because of this geomagnetic storm, which is about to hit us. So Hurricane Irma is going to intensify because of the geomagnetic storm and become the strongest storm in, human, in recorded human history. And there are going to be health effects and human effects. Be safe, everyone.